something maybe the viewers would be um, surprised about is a dish here or some food that's called pag pag. You're familiar with pag pag? Uh, I, I am, but I haven't tried it. Um, <laughs> right, just explain them for, uh, so to pag the people pag what is, pag pag is. Originates in 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 Smoky Mountain in Tondo and Smoky Mountain and um, around Happy Land, which are two of the super poor areas of Metro Manila. And what it is is all the restaurants of Makati and Quezon City and all the Manila people go around and they and they do it's called tapan basura which means literally it means sort through the trash and they try to get there as soon as the restaurants have chucked out their their night's um garbage so that they can get there before the garbage pickup and they collect as much of this leftover food as they can and then they ship it to places in tondo and they have where you'd have a carinderia like in the normal streets they have pug pug carried areas, which is literally like dishes that they make out of leftover food. Like that's, it's, yeah, it's been somebody's leftovers, right? And what happens is that in the poor areas, they make, they make money off this. It's lucrative because it's a lot cheaper. Um, they sell it. So I don't exactly know the meaning of pug pug, but it's pretty much a mixture. It's like everything that's in the trash, then they sort through it. And they just mix it all up and stir fry it and serve it to, to people that are living in that in the area. And I've never tried it personally. Um, but there's a lot of people that do eat that. On they, yeah, basis. They, there's a lot of places that, actually, COVID and the pandemic it actually ruined a lot of people. Like they were starving because the restaurants they weren't doing dine-ins, so they were all doing deliveries, like grab deliveries, and, and um, so they weren't chucking out food. There was no there was no trash food, and a lot of the pug pugs places stopped making that food uh, i know this because I, I do a little little bit of work in tondo and metro manila and i actually i work as volunteer with um a couple of different charity groups that their main goal is to uh, serve the poor and help do feeding programs and uh do medical uh you know help get medicines for the kids like basic vitamins and minerals is, is the is the thing so yeah, yeah, Pag Pag is something like, I can't say I want to try it, like, um, it's not on my bucket list of food for the Philippines, but um, there's been a documentary about it, and it's it's become known around the world that it exists, but yeah, it's just another way, uh, like earlier, like, it's a way that Filipinos that are in diehard circumstance, like extreme poverty, they've managed to take one man's trash and turn it into something you know, up, upcycled it and, and made it something that was uh, not just consumable, but also, you know, a viable uh, a contribution to their local economies, man. Like, yeah, it's pretty nuts. I think they call it like Filipino survival food. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it is. It is it, it's definitely a Filipino survival food. Um, I know that in even outside of Manila, like in other, in province areas that are, built near resorts and stuff they do that like in the ghetto parts of those areas they're still doing it 